This is the Huawei Y9 2019, the company's latest mid-range phone. It is a replacement to the highly successful Mate 10 Pro. Will it be able to live up to the expectations set by its predecessor? Let's find out. We will be also comparing Nova 3i with Y9 soon, so stay tuned. Coming to the design, the design is shiny gloss finish that shines brilliantly with light. The sides are made of sturdy aluminium and the bottom uses micro USB accompanied by a single grill speaker. When we compare the Y9 with the Nova 3i, you can see that there is a good difference between the two phones. The Nova 3i has a richer finish to it, but different people have different tastes. There are two cameras on the top of the phone for selfies, a 13 megapixel f1.8 and a 2 megapixel f2.4 depth sensor to capture some great photos. The phone is powered by a Karen 710 processor, which is mid-range processor. It does a superb job of keeping up with our daily tasks with a little bit of interruption. Now moving on to the display. The display is a 6.5 inch IPS display with a resolution of 1080 by 2340 pixels at a 396 ppi. The phone has a smooth rounded corner and a small chin. There are a lot of options to adjust color tones and saturation settings within the settings for you to customize how the display looks for you. With the Nova 3i side by side, they both have the same specifications but the Y9 is only bigger by 0.3 inches in the display department. Let's talk about the camera. The phone has dual front facing cameras, a primary 16 megapixel f2.0 and a secondary 2 megapixel f2.4 depth sensor for capturing some great photos at close range. It does compare well with the Nova 3i which also shares the same camera specifications. There are plenty of options here for photographers to edit photos, manual settings and lots of other modes for everyone keen on taking photos to play around with. So overall, I think it's a good camera for daily usage. No problems here. Well, coming on to the interface, the phone uses the MUI 8.2 interface that is proprietary to Huawei. The phone is running on Android 8.1 Oreo. The OS is quick, responsive and very optimized for the phone. The settings and home menu has plenty to offer and lots to discover for curious users. So look around. Well, we have tested this phone for like a week or so and the battery timing is really good. We are able to scrounge up a day and a half of usage from the Y9 2019 due to the massive 4000 mAh battery. Now if you are into gaming, this phone might not be the strongest phone but it manages to run games surprisingly well on medium to high settings. Just mix and match your ideal settings with each game and you are good to go. So play along. The speaker quality is ok but you shouldn't expect too much from the device in terms of loudness. Now coming on to the conclusion, overall it is a solid phone compared to the Nova 3i. The Y9 retails at a competitive price of 37,999 rupees against the Nova 3i at 40,999. Both phones have the same processor in them. So you are going to be getting Nova 3i experience with a bigger screen but slightly weaker front camera. I think the choice is obviously here. So if you do like this review, please share your thoughts in the comments below and do subscribe and take care.